Hey guys, it's Sarah Ann Gizmo. Welcome back to our channel. This has definitely become our channel. He loves being in these videos. And I will warn you guys, he has been completely rambunctious this morning. So if he makes a lot of commotion, I apologize in advance. I'm gonna try to share this deal with you guys. So today's deal comes to you from CVS. It was a huge deal that I attempted and I will say it was a success. I had no issues with coupons. It was fantastic. So I got about $185 worth of product and my subtotal was $6.59. Unbelievable. So that was after my extra bucks and everything. But you guys, I earned all of my extra bucks back in either more extra bucks or Ibotta rebates, which is cash, you guys. So let me share these deals with you guys. I hope some of these help you to get your own fantastic deals at CVS. Um, these will be contingent on what CRTs you have and what paper and printable coupons you have and of course what Ibotta rebates you have. If you are new to my channel, thank you for watching. I would appreciate a thumbs up if you like seeing CVS videos. Feel free to drop a comment down below letting me know that you stopped by. I so appreciate those. And I will leave a printable breakdown for you guys in the description box as well as a link to Ibotta and other fantastic rebate apps so that you can take advantage of these amazing deals as well. Okay, so let's start with some oral care. Um, this week at CVS, any of the Colgate Total Oral Care is spend $8 and get a $4 extra buck. It's a limit of two. So as you can see, I grabbed three of the Total SF Whitening, and these are the 4.8 ounces, and they are the paste. And then I grabbed this Total SF Deep Clean, and it's 5.1 ounces, and it is also a paste. So my store was super limited on Colgate items in general. I mean, the store was wiped out. I was kind of nervous that I wasn't gonna get to do this deal at all, um, or that it was gonna be more expensive than I had planned. And it ended up working out great. So the, the Colgate, this one, the Deep Clean that's bigger, the 5.1 ounce, um, that one was $4.99. And then the whitening 4.8 ounces were $3.79 in my store. So my total for all four was $16.36. I used a $3 off of two digital Colgate Total SF coupon. I used two of the dollar paper coupons from the 104 Smart Source, or there were some printables that we had on coupons.com last week. So you can mix and match those. And then I used a four off of 16 Colgate CRT. So my final cost, if I did the math correctly, is $7.36 for this toothpaste, and I got back an $8 extra buck. So we start out with a money maker there. And we follow up with another money maker. So the Skintimate disposable razors are on sale for $5.99 this week. And when you buy three, you get a $5 extra buck. This is a limit of one. So I grabbed three at $5.99. The total for these was $17.97. I used a $4 Skintimate digital. And I used two of the $4 printable coupons that are available on coupons.com. I also used a three off of 12 Schick Disposable Razor CRT. So my final cost was $2.97 for these three razors, three packs of razors, and I got back a $5 extra buck, making this a $2.03 money maker. So, so excited about that deal. I also grabbed a lot of cosmetics, so we'll see if we can avoid some of the glare. The CoverGirl blush, this is not the Cheekers, this is the large blush. These are $7.99 at my store. And then I grabbed a mascara that was $6.99 at my store. This week when you buy two CoverGirl cosmetics, you get back a $6 extra buck and it is a limit of one. So my total for these two items was $14.98. I used a $2 CoverGirl Face Digital Manufacturer Coupon. 
And then I used a $2 CoverGirl eye coupon. And we have either one from the 10 for Retail Me Not, or there was a printable for this one. And then I used a three off of 15 CoverGirl CRT. So my final cost for both was $7.98, and I got back a $6 extra buck. The Skin to Mitt Shave Gel is on sale two for $6 this week. And when you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck. This is a limit of one. So I used a dollar digital on the shave gel. I also used a dollar printable from coupons.com. And I used a two off of six Skin to Mitt Shave Cream CRT. So my final cost was $2 and I got back a $2 extra buck. Awesome. So the Advil this week, when you buy one of any Advil 36 count or larger, you get a $2 extra buck and it is a limit of one. So I grabbed the 100 coated tablets and in my store that was $10.29. I used a $3 Advil 72 count or larger digital and I used a two off of 10 pain relief CRT. So my final cost was $5.29 and I got back that $2 extra buck. You can see my cat's happy about that. His tail was twitching about that deal. So when he's running around wild and I need some headache medicine, now I have some. <laughs> okay, so the next deal I got was a spend 35 and get back a $15 extra buck deal and it's a limit of one. So I, you know, I try to look at my CRTs and, and figure out what will make a good deal as well as, can, you know, how can I get the most product, the most bang for my buck. So some of this deal, the Suave is not included in the 35, spend 35, get 15 extra bucks deal but I grabbed it because I wanted the Olay, which is included, and I had a body wash CRT that I wanted to pair with that to lower my out of pocket. And I got a ton of body wash here, guys. So um, let me share with you guys what I did. And of course, as I keep saying, you will just wanna look at your own CRTs and see what makes sense for you. So I picked up one of the Userin Original Healing Lotions. This is the 16.9 fluid ounce pump. So this is $12.99 at my store. Now we do have an Ibotta rebate for that, giving me back $3. Check your Ibotta accounts and see what you have. And then I grabbed one of these Eucerin Calming Creams, the eight ounce, and this is $9.79 at my store. And we have an Ibotta dollar and 50 cent rebate on that one. There's also an Ibotta bonus when you buy two Eucerin items, you get another dollar. So Ibotta is giving me, they already gave me $5.50 for buying these two Eucerin. So then I grabbed these two Olay body washes and they're on sale two for $12. And I grabbed three of the Swap body washes. They only had one of the Ocean Breeze and then they, the rest, um, I had to grab the men's, which is fine. So these are $2.19 each. Three of them were $6.57. And again, just to reiterate, these three are not included in the spend 35, get 15. I just picked these up to use a body wash CRT. So my total for the promotion items was $34.58. And that is um, close enough to the $35 mark to qualify for that $15 extra buck. My total for all of these items, including the swab, was $41.35. So I used two $3.50 printable coupons from userin.us website. And then I used a $2 off of $10 Userin Lotion CRT. I used a $2 off of two Olay Body Wash Digital Manufacturer Coupon. And I also used a $2 off of two Suave body wash CRT. And since I spent over $18 on all five body wash, I could use a $3 off of 18 body wash CRT. 
So my total out of pocket for all seven of these items was $25.35 and I got back that $15 extra buck. But then I also got back $5.50 from Ibotta on the Userin. So my total ended up being, my final cost was $20.85 for all seven of these items, which I thought was a really great price. And we have some more cosmetics. So I grabbed a L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara, and this one was $11.49 in my store. And they were really wiped out of the mascaras. So I just, you know, I grabbed one that they had left. And then I grabbed a L'Oreal Mono Eyeshadow, and these are $6.99 in my store. So this week, when you spend $15 on L'Oreal Cosmetics, you get back a $5 extra buck. It's a limit of three, but I only did it once today. I may go back later this week. My total for these two items was $18.48. I had a free L'Oreal Mascara CRT that I used, and then I used the $4 L'Oreal Cosmetics it was actually L'Oreal or Maybelline Cosmetics CRT that printed at the Redbox last week. So after those two CRTs, my final cost for these two items was $2.99 and I got back a $5 extra buck. The Revlon this week, when you spend $10, you get a $4 extra buck. It's a limit of six. I did it two times today. I bought a Colorstay pressed powder for $12.49. And then I bought a mascara, and this is the Ultimate All-in-One Mascara, and this is $9.49 at my store. So my total for both was $21.98. I used a $4 Revlon face product coupon from the 10 for Smart Source for the powder, and I used a $3 Revlon mascara coupon from the 10 for Smart Source for the mascara, and then I used a $6 off of $20 Revlon CRT. So my final cost for both was $8.98 and I got back an $8 extra buck. There are probably cheaper ways you can do this, but as I say in all my videos, I get what I will use or what someone I know will use. So the, the pressed powder is something that I use like every day. Um, so I definitely wanted to grab that, but there may be even cheaper Revlon items out there if you are interested in just a lower overall expense. And then the Alme, I think this is my final deal to share with you guys. Um, the Alme is same deal as Revlon. When you spend 10, you get a $4 extra buck. It's a limit of six. So I did this one twice today as well. I got one Alme shadow quad, shadow squad, I think it said on the website. It's a quad though, um, eyeshadow. And these are $7.49. And then I grabbed two of the Micellar Makeup Remover Wipes. These are $6.59 each. So my total for all three items was $20.67. I used a $3 off of two Alme Wipes coupon from the 10 for Smart Source. And I used a $3 Alme Eye coupon from the 10 for Smart Source. I also used a $6 off of $20 Alme CRT. So my final cost for the Alme products was $8.67 and I got back that $8 extra buck. So I wrote down my subtotal for everything. If I did all this math correctly, um, my subtotal for everything was $71.59. And sorry about my cat guys. He's, yeah, he's just having a time today. Um, I used $65 in extra bucks to pay, and I used a Fetch gift card for the tax and everything. Um, I got back $59 in extra bucks, $5.50 from Ibotta, and I will get back at least $6 in beauty bucks, but I'm thinking I will get more like nine. So if I get six back, then again, if I'm doing the math correctly, then that means all of this cost me less than $2. Um, if I get $9 in beauty bucks back, then I made a dollar and some change on all of these items. Either way, I'm thrilled. Let me know what you guys think about the CVS deals this week in the comments below and what deals you plan to do. 
I hope this helps you guys out and I will be back soon with another deal for you guys from either Walmart, Kroger, Walgreens, or maybe another CVS deal. All right, guys, well, have a wonderful week. Thank you so much for watching, liking, sharing, and subscribing. And until next time, guys, happy couponing.